Meghan Markle and Prince Harry's Hollywood comeback is already in jeopardy because executives have had enough of them and the royal family has played a blinder by ignoring their negative attacks, Britain's leading PR guru claimed today. The Duchess of Sussex recently signed with William Morris Endeavour, WME, mega agent Ari Emanuel whose clients include Dwayne The Rock Johnson, Serena Williams and other A-listers, but WME is reportedly having second thoughts. Meghan also appeared on the red carpet at Variety's Power of Women Gala where she teased exciting new projects for her and Harry. She also sat with two of Lass' most powerful women, one working for the Oscars and another high up at Universal Studio. But Mark Borkowski, one of Britain's most experienced crisis managers, has said that he believes that Omid Scobie's endgame, and the royal race row it sparked, has backfired spectacularly for the Duke and Duchess of Sussex. He is also convinced that the Farago over the Dutch translation naming King Charles and Kate was clearly a publicity stunt, a claim Mr. Scobie denies. Mr. Borkowski has said that Meghan's Hollywood relaunch is clearly not working. He claims that her new talent agency WME may be considering dropping her after less than six months amid signs the Hollywood machine has probably had enough of them. He told Mail Online, something is beginning to unwind at the heart of Meghan and Harry. I think 2024 is going to be seismic, either because they're going to do something to recover and find a new positive tactic or it's going to be the undoing of the brand. It can only go one or two ways. It can stay where it is at the moment. Because it's clearly not work, he said the couple's brand could be finished in the next year because they are viewed so negatively, in part because of the dignified silence from the royal family in the face of constant attacks by the Sussexes and their allies.